there is a disease going around. Right CVPs, it's a beautiful day to be alive right now. It's really a beautiful day. And I am Caroline. If you are new here, welcome. I welcome you. It's awesome to see you. If you are a CVP, yay! <laughs> I love my CVPs. CVP stands for Caroline Von Petzl, like basically my initials. So you guys are my, my beautiful CVPs. So we are heading right now to the park to fly home. It's really early again. I'm trying to avoid drama. I'm trying not to do any dog drama anymore because I just want to fly home and have my privacy. It's not like something I look for. You know, this is a park where we fly since a year now and dogs being off leash is always a problem. Even though this park has a strict law leash enforcement like it's the law to have your dog on the leash at all times but people don't abide by the rules so that's the thing yeah so I'm going now extra early to avoid those uh, law-breaking dog owners who would let their dogs off leash I don't have a problem with dogs I love dogs the only thing is I have a problem if they are off leash in this park because I fly my bird there and in this park it's the law that the dog has to be leash. I love dogs I have nothing against dogs if I see a dog and my bird is not with me I'm gonna go over there and cuddle him and touch him and <coughs> kiss him you know but if my bird is there I'm very protective of my bird because I don't want anything happen to him it's kind of like a mother instinct like I really am afraid of like dog chases that's the reason why I'm always so sensitive when dogs are off the leash because I want that the dogs will be not off the leash I want them on the leash to keep everybody safe and happy so that's where I'm coming from I hope you can understand my side I'm not a dog hater I'm not an animal hater I love animals with all my heart with all my soul I grew up on a farm so I love animals now I prefer birds because I have birds and I can't have a dog or a cat because it will be a liability and I don't really want to be liable for like you know anything happened to my birds because they are my babies they are like my kids I'm like the mother of dragons it's like the Khaleesi in Games of Thrones who's very protective of the dragons that's it guys that's it all what I want is to fly my bird have fun uh, and there are again dogs off leash but it is still a happy day because we are in the park and hope hasn't flown for forever because there was a fire and then there's uh, not as nice weather but today is a beautiful day so I see dogs there but I'll just fly him because where else should I go so let's get him out of the car and let's go fly him a few moments later oh i am so lucky the dogs just left look it's all empty, it's all empty. okay hope let's come on come on go 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 i love my bird are you happy you want to go fly okay he's happy okay let me get the leash and the keys hold on hope don't poop on me please because i'm all in yellow today uh-huh go fly Whoa. there he goes he's happy i'm happy to, to be in the park so he can fly oh poop Whee! good boy hope Whee! <laughs> he hasn't flown for like hours We're gonna ah. sit right here. There's a beautiful oh, that's all over dog poop. 
I don't know, there's like this weird stuff all over. I think we'll sit right here. No, then we are in the sun. Let's go in the shade. I'm gonna sit in the shade. I hope that we have our selfie stick there too. Alright, we will sit right here in the shade so I can talk to you guys. Yay! <laughs> How you like my new hat? You like my new hat? Yeah? Come on. Hi. Hi. Ah! Are you happy? Are you happy? Are you happy? We're in the park now. Good boy. Good boy. wants to be in the best spot let her, let me ask him to poop -poo first because once he poops I don't need to worry him pooping on me Hopi do you want to no you're not going on the floor oh no no you see he wants to go on the floor no you're not allowed to no no I got you I, I got you okay go fly go Incoming bird. Uh oh, look, there's a German Shepherd. Okay, guys, so I just noticed there's a German Shepherd, but it's, he's on the leash, so we are happy. <laughs> we are happy. <laughs> oh, this is gorgeous day. Yeah, I don't have a problem with dogs in the park. They can be in the park, you know? I just have a problem if they're off the leash chasing my bird. Oh, I know they need to run, I know they need to exercise, but they are dog parks. This is not a dog. But yeah, let's focus on something more beautiful. On a happy note, <laughs> let's have some exercise with Hope. Hope, can I, can I, can I twirl you? Hope, can I twirl? Oh, he's so happy. <laughs> Hope, can I twirl you? <laughs> what are you doing? Okay, let's go race. Let's go race. Yeah, let's go race. One. Hope, you want to go race? You want to race? Run. Two. Three. again but we're not cheating this time okay so we'll just go a straight line one two three go ah! Ah! good workout. This was so much fun. Are you having fun, Hope? Mm. Are you? Because I'm having fun with you. Mm. I love my bird. <laughs> no. 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 I love my bird. Yes, he's so calm and so gentle and so loving. And that's what you achieve with baby birds, right? I raise you well. Can I kiss you? 
I'm addicted to kissing hope. <laughs> Love you so much. Can I blow? Can I blow? Can I blow? I'm gonna blow your back. I'm gonna blow your back. You like it? He likes it. Again. Oh, look at his face. <laughs> Do you like it? Oh my god. Look at look how serious he is. He's so serious. You baby. Oh, poo poo. Make poo poo. Poo poo. Poo poo. Poo poo. Good boy. <laughs> He can do poo poo on command. I'm training our little baby love doing poo poo on command. So he's already doing poo poo on command with 16 weeks old. That's awesome. Okay, go fly. There you go. There you go. Hope he's on the tree. Having fun on the tree. Right there. Right there. Help me. I just noticed that my my piggy tail is like on a line, on a line. Okay, are they in line now? Yes, perfect. <laughs> All right, guys. So I want to talk to you about a very serious subject. There is a disease going around right now. It's called Newcastle, and it's killing chickens. And it's so vicious and so bad. Um, this disease was once already here in the USA, like I think in 2002 or so, and they had to euthanize, like euthanize mean kill, 8,000 chickens. And mostly this disease started in a chicken farm, and I don't know what they're doing, but those chicken farms, they don't do really the, the chickens properly or something. So there's a lot of diseases going out, and now, there's like a notification from the state veterinary of California to utilize chickens and birds. All birds that has the Newcastle virus will be mandatory eliminated, which means euthanized, which means killed. This is a serious issue because it's not really nice and this disease can spread really fast. And I'm gonna link the website below so you can guys can read about it. I just want to inform you, you have to be very careful with places that sell chickens. The virulent Newcastle disease has been diagnosed in Southern California. This disease does not affect humans, but it can kill birds in just a matter of days. The birds become infected by coming in contact with other birds carrying the disease or by humans carrying the disease in their clothing or shoes. Don't move your birds. If you have birds that appear to be ill, please call the State Bird Hotline at 1-866-922-2473. It's chicken eggs, chicken, everything with chickens. Um, I mean, you're good when you eat chickens, but the thing is, for the birds, they are not good. So if you have chickens in your backyard, don't let your birds interact with the chickens. Don't let your birds interact with your friend's chickens and this virus will spread really really fast and the symptoms is like runny nose, droopy eyes, um, vomiting, diarrhea and it's it's really serious guys so I just want to like notify you there's a disease going around called Newcastle disease Vil Vi v Newcastle disease and it's not good for birds. It's not good for our pet parrots. Our pet parrots can get that disease too, but you have to be very careful and avoid places that sell birds. So I'm not going to any places that sell birds just because I don't wanna like, you know, bring this disease home or have my bird like catch it and then all my flock is gonna die. And I don't want to like have to watch like how um, the cops 
cops are coming in and just says hey you have like parrots uh, we are here to like mandatory euthanize your parrots this is crazy guys this is really not like it's not a nothing thing it's really a huge thing um, yeah I want you to educate yourself read about it and be really careful with your pets don't go around um, with other pets and don't be around like people that have birds I mean for me as a free flyer it's hard because we free fly and we socialize with other birds but right now um, my birds are all in quarantine that means I don't socialize my birds with other birds um, I free fly Hope who's still up there in a tree but he's not sitting and kissing any like hawks or like pigeon or parrot, wild parrots. So he's flying around in the air. He can't get this disease flying around, but um, they can get and transfer it if, if, if they have like physical contact. So it's really important for you guys to know about this. So I, I just want to put it out there. There's a disease going around. Oh, oh, oh. hi home. Uh, there's a disease going around called Newcastle virus and it's not a joke. This is serious business and birds can die. So just be please really really careful with your birds. Hi. Hi, I hope you're back. You're back. Hi. He's looking at... What are you looking at? <laughs> this is our little game. I hope. Hi. What do you want to do? Look at his colors. His colors is changing. Look at his colors. Look how beautiful. He's so beautiful. My bird is such a beautiful bird. I love him. Look at his feet. Yeah. Feet. <laughs> I love being silly with my bird. <laughs> Ah! Mm. My chicken. Where's my little chicken? guys i hope you enjoy it let me know what you think give us a thumbs up because we love having thumbs up and subscribe if you are new if you are not new i love you and you guys are amazing comment below i read all the comments and today's shout out goes to this person congratulations ah and this person congratulations guys hit the subscribe button and i will see you tomorrow hope go fly also guys, check out my other channel, angelicparrots.com. I post just awesome little birdie clips, um, beautiful little clips of my uh, angelic flock. So check it out, Angelic Parrots. Um, link is in the description. I will love for you to subscribe because I think we are just like 70 subscribers away from 1,000 subscribers. Yay! <laughs> so without you guys... Oh, there's Hopi. Hopi! There's Hope. He's flying. He's happy. So thank you for subscribing. Thank you for loving us. We love you too. Hopi, come in. There's Hopi. Hi. <laughs> Are you ready to go home? All right. Let's go home. Good boy. You're so good. You're so good. You're so good. Yeah. Mm. Now it's four o'clock and dogs are arriving on the park. Um, in the park so I better put secure Hope. And we are done. We just flew like 30 minutes. We are done in the park and let's go home and let's play with Angel. Ah! Yeah, and let's play with little baby. Ah! Oh, you still want to fly? 
You still want to fly? No, we are done. <laughs> Bye, guys. I have a flower here. Look at her. Drop it! No, he's eating the... So.